لازم اقول له لا اتخانق لوحدك مش هتخانق معاك لازم يكون في طريقه تانيه من هنا لازم يكون في طريقه تانيه Again.
بالشمس بس في حاجة ضايعة منه Check your corners. You still here, Joey? This is Mailman 21 Actual. Joey, do you hear me? How copy? Over. It's Joey's. He's in bad shape. We gotta move fast. You were with Lance Corporal Gomez, right? What actually happened to him? He died. Whatever's out there now, sure shit ain't Joey. Well, in battle, these things are often difficult to judge. What's that supposed to mean? You could've been mistaken, Sergeant. Check your weapons. Don't leave anything to chance. Corporal Gomez, this is... How deep is that damn hole? Saw fishers like this back at the temple. Best guess is the quakes open them up. Let's just keep going. This fucking place. Is that blood? Something really fucking nasty went down here. Double time. Joey needs us now. We gotta hurry. Ah! Ah! Joe, that you? He's right. Advance with caution. Mailman 3 to Mailman 2, 1 Actual. Come in, Lieutenant, over. This is Mailman 3 to Mailman 2, 1 Actual. Come in, Lieutenant, over. Mailman 3 to Dropkick. Colonel, are you there? Over. 
Hallo.
me in my life. But never that ugly. What the fuck are we up against? Those things are everywhere. Never before have I ever seen anything so vicious. What do you think those things are? You know what? I, I don't know. I didn't think to ask. How about you? Do you believe in demons? If you'd asked me that before, I'd have laughed in your face. But now, in the Sumerian myth, they say the souls of the dead went deep underground to the House of Ashes, where they lived on dust, plagued by the demons of the underworld. I can't even begin to comprehend that. Like you, I also never believed. But look around you. Look where we are. Look what we have seen. We are trapped in the Sumerian temple. Well, if we're in hell, I guess you should at least know my name. Nikke, Sergeant. Selim Osman, Lieutenant. Iraqi Army. Shukran, ya khuya. This is Mailman 2 and Actual to Mailman 3. How copy over? Hey, solid copy, LT. I see your light. Keep moving forward. I'm just ahead. Over. I'm coming to get you. Your friends better not do anything dumb. I said, you gotta trust me. They won't hurt you. Drop your weapon now! Stop pointing your guns at me! All right, everyone, take a fucking second. He's not hostile. I don't want to hurt you. Don't make a mistake you're gonna regret, soldier. Put your gun down, now! No, you lower yours first. Drop your weapon or we will fire. Are you hearing me? Drop your weapon now! I didn't come this far to die by a trigger. Happy American! Okay, enough! There's no point in fighting. Not anymore. Put one through your fucking skull. It won't change anything. I'd still be in this hell. Don't tempt me. We're heading back to the temple. Tie him up. If he tries anything, put him down. After all we've been through? Thanks a lot. My god. You were right. What the hell is that thing? Makes your anus pucker, don't it? Hey, you two boys do this together? Of course we did. We fought it together and we won. Jason, we need to talk about this guy. Not now. This plan's a bust. Whatever the hell happened to Joey, he's gone. And there are fuck knows how many of those things out there. I say we pull back to the temple and regroup. I think that's the best plan I heard all day. Suit yourself. I want you to tell me everything you know about these creatures. 
Have you seen them before? Do you know where they came from? How many are there down here? I hope you are a believer, brother. When those things come back, you're going to need a higher power to pray to. My name is Lieutenant Colonel Eric King of the United States Air Force. I'm a chief nuclear engineer of the Iraq Survey Group, tasked with locating hidden chemical weapons. Our mission has uncovered something unexpected. I will now begin an autopsy of an unidentified life form. Slowed him down. Long enough to spot them on the cameras. We should reset that trip wire. Give me a hand. We've been in some fucked up situations before. Never as fucked as this. If I gotta fight these things, there's no one else I would want by my side. You know how I always got your back, buddy. Come with me. Something else. You think? I wonder how many places like this we've bombed without a second thought. These relics are better off in the dust. What's your problem? These people didn't ask for this war. People never have a good answer for that. If I get asked. Mailman 2-1 Actual, this is Dropkick. Request update, over. 2-1 Actual receiving. Cameras are green and the holes have been demolished, over. Good work, Lieutenant. Treat through the eastern corridor and be on your guard, over. I hear you, over and out. Approximation, the creature is eight feet tall, bipedal, winged. Wing webbing appears to be affixed to its forelimbs and to the digits of its hands. Epidermis looks to be smothered in some sort of excretion. Underneath it is diseased almost. The creature is starting to rapidly decompose in death. Dropkick, this is Mailman 21 Actual, approaching Eastern Passage. Over. I see you. Christ, these doors took a hammer in. Those things must have come through here in force. Whoever manned that weapon took a stand and held them off. Before they got massacred from behind. These creatures aren't dumb. They're predators. Bet your bottom dollar if they came this way before, they could come again.
closest have been to hell. Looks like he's been drained dry. It's gotta be one of those explorers. Blowing a hole through the rock face, we found a gateway to a strange world below. A phosphorescence emanated from beneath, casting its eldritch light over us all. Lady Bradshaw was insistent that we descend further. Perhaps Mary is right, and Bradshaw is becoming reckless and uncontrollable. But I can't stop thinking about what's down there. I am now working with Crow and Pullman to set up a winch and elevator to descend into the shaft. What mysteries lie below, I wonder, undisturbed by the world above. What's that? It says they found something weird down here. Yeah, no shit. Deserve that. Kill by a stake through the heart. <laughs> Pretty sure those creatures didn't do this. Who did? I don't know. Buffy? Who? Maybe you should hold on to that. Never know when you're gonna need a sharp mistake, right? More crap. What'd you find? Nothing that's gonna get us out of here. Crown Jewels of England. Perfect. This looks like a good choke point. Any of those freaks coming up from below are sure to pass through here. Set some chargers? Yeah. Yeah, rig these pillars for maximum coverage. More likely to see the trip wires, though. You think those things can tell the difference? We shouldn't underestimate them. We mine the sides. We're more likely to catch them out. Smaller spread, but the explosives are better hidden. What do you think? Those things are devious fuckers. You're right. We plant the charges to the side of the hall. All right. They won't see this one coming. I can hear your brain taking away. 
What is it? Should have given her a second warning. Fuck, man, I wish I hadn't asked. I'm through talking about this. Yeah? What's left to say? You know that checkpoint was a prime target for suicide bombers. We had to act in the moment. We had to make a call. It was the wrong call. Why is it that no one ever tells us straight? Everyone just makes up bullshit to get by. That's why we're in the sandbox in the first place, right? I just want the truth, Jason. Shooting that woman messed with my head. You seriously gonna tell me it didn't mess with yours, man? We fucked up. If we make it out of here, we'll face up to that. If we die down here, maybe it's what we deserve. You know I was seeing Rachel. Are you serious? Been three weeks. It's on. Dropkick, this is Mailman 21 Actual. We're at a stairwell leading down into a maze. Please advise, over. Acknowledged. Pull back now and secure the perimeter. Drop kick out. Mount a camera here, and let's head back. Can't be anything good.
hell is that light? Creature has powerful claws and fangs formed from hardened and identifiable tissue. Two of the incisors appear grossly malformed and discolored, oddly out of place. The membrane surrounding the specimen seems to originate from its mouth. Blood is like nothing I've seen. I'll now perform a UV sweep to further inspect the fluids. Hey, some advice? You had your chance to talk. Yes, but the demon does not react well to sunlight. I would be very careful with that light. I said be quiet. Oh boy. Don't move! Cool check, is that you? Damn you! Shit! Looks like a line out. Maybe we can get the radio working and send a signal out. It's worth a shot. A long shot. Oh, we don't even know if there's a 
working transmitter on the surface. Those wires gotta go somewhere, though. You think they still work? Well, looks to me like they just snagged up. Don't feel much like climbing out there. <laughs> What the fuck, Joey? Oh, We have to hurry. It's not safe here. that you could fight yeah me either what was that thing i don't know whatever it is it's not alone where have you been one of those things got its dirty hands on me dragged me down here left me for dead fuck fuck doesn't even start to cut it i'm lucky to have gotten away you're talking to a scientist there's no such thing as luck you should be thankful i was there to help you I'm really grateful. Thank you. Semper Fi. We gotta find a way out of this hole. So, this is where you've been hiding out? Do you have any weapons? Uh, do you mind? Just need some batteries for this damn light. You could just ask. That ever cross your mind? Looks painful. Yeah. It is. Think you can keep still? I'm glad you're here. Yeah. Well, I guess I'm a little glad too. I saw those same symbols in the shepherd's huts. Those people must have been in the valley a long time. <coughs> There's a way up. There's no way we're making it. Look at it. It's barely climbable. We can make it together. How did I know you were going to say that? I met Eric in climbing glass. I can get us out of here.
You okay? Yeah, just need a minute. A minute isn't gonna kill us. Until it does. God, you, you look terrible. Gee, thanks, Rachel. You ever think about going into motivational speaking? Seriously, though, are you okay? That's gotta be about the dumbest question I have ever been asked. Give me the silent treatment, huh? I think right now we should just focus on survival. It's no wonder they call you the queen bitch. Sad thing is you don't even see it. See what exactly? You don't let anyone in. It's like there's a wall around you. No, not, not even a wall, a mountain. Tell me, Rachel. Is there even a real person behind there? It's not easy being queen bitch. You think I got where I am with a soft word and a warm smile? And here's me thinking you Langley types grew up on Easy Street. <laughs> easy Street? I had to graph to get here. You think it bothers me what people call me? I wear that shit like a badge of fucking honor. They have no idea of the shit hill I've climbed just to get to where I am right now. Yeah? And where is that exactly? Looks like another shit hill if I'm truly honest with myself. <laughs> you and I, we're not so different. You know, both doing what needed to be done to get to where we wanted to be. No shame in that. No shame. What did that thing do to you? Please! Please don't leave me down here alone! It's okay. I'm here. did that thing do to you? There's medication up there. It may help you, but we need to move now. <clears throat> side of the chasm. We'll never make it. <laughs> Don't quit on me now. <laughs> we have to swing over. That rope won't hold. Wait! Do you really believe those medicines will help me? Keep it together, Clarice. We're almost there. You didn't answer my question. Where I see it? It's your only hope. We can do this. Ugh! <sighs> 
You okay? <coughs> that answer your question? We need to get you to the temple. <laughs> 